as we all know, Austria is a sovereign country. But it was not always like this. In May 1938, Germany marched on and occupied Austria in what was known then as the Anschluss Österreichs. What was known before as the Austrian football has been incorporated in the German leagues. SK Rapid Vienna has joined the Gau Liga Ostmark, the highest football league in Austria after the Anschluss, alongside Wacker Vienna and Admira Vienna. Rapid Vienna would go on and become the most successful of the Austrian clubs, winning the DFB Pokal, or Chamar Pokal as it was known in 1938, against FSV Frankfurt and then would go on and win the German league. The most dominant club of Germany at that time was Schalke. Yes, the same Schalke who now are languishing in the German second division. But in 1941, there was a clash between the best club in Germany and the best one from Austria. A clash won by Rapid Vienna following a comeback worthy of Anfield. Nowadays, the Austrian football is dominated by Red Bull Salzburg and this is no different in football manager. As we can see, the Grünen are trailing the Salzburg club for quite some time now and have not won the Austrian league since the 2007-2008 season. This provides a great platform for a rebuild in Football Manager. As history shows us, the club has character and can overcome the obstacles. Now, with the lack of funding and the 34 million euros debt hanging over the club, it will be quite hard to overcome a team like Salzburg led by a global company. But as recent league results show us, this is doable. The club is renowned for its fit for finding young talents and in FM22 you do have Leopold Kierfeld, Enes Tepecic or Tobias Hedl to nurture for future success or future profit. Oh, and yes, let's not forget about Yusuf Demir, the ultimate FM wonder kit. He has recently signed a new contract and if you can hold him and develop him at the club, he would explode in possibly the best player Rapid Vienna and Austria have had in modern history. He's 18 years old and has the qualities of a prime midfielder. He's a versatile player, capable of playing anywhere in the final third of the pitch, but I would use him as an attacking midfielder. His finishing and passing abilities need to be developed more and he can become the ultimate attacking midfielder. The player that comes to my mind when I see Yusuf Demir is Bruno Fernandes. He could very well become as good as or better than the Portuguese midfielder. The Rapid Vienna squad also has Marco Grull, Leo Greimler and Paul Gattler. It is true, 81 years ago, the football scenery looked very different. We did not have Red Bull or scouting in different places of the globe to find players. But, and this may apply only to football manager, anything is possible and any story can become true. So why not manage Rapid Vienna, the Austrian champions of Germany? Or if you think the Austrian football or Rapid Vienna is not a big enough challenge, then maybe you would like to take part in the Turkish football restructuring. To find out more about it, make sure to watch this video next. I'm Alex and I thank you for watching today's video. As always, dear audience, stay safe, relax and have fun.